I'd like to welcome everybody back to the channel at Boo's Sneaker Review 8. Tonight we're going to be reviewing the Lamella Ball MB3 Halloween shoe. I hope you guys got this. Again, this is not the MB4. He's doing, a, I think, a, just a one-off on this Halloween shoe. The box is bright orange. Check it out. It says, not from here on the front, Mellow 3. And then on the side, you've got the normal rare. And then you've also got this little Halloween thing right there. And then on the back, you've got Trick or Treat right there. And then before we get to the shoe, I also want to show you something on the inside of the box. See the inside? So this is truly a Halloween shoe. So then let's get to the shoe. So here's the shoe. It's bright orange with black on it. Basically kind of looks like a pumpkin carved course let's just start with one this right here is my favorite part of the shoe this mimics see that part right there you see the looks like a jack-o-lantern right on the very front of the shoe but like all the lamellos you've got the one of one on the tongue and the rare his signature And nothing's really changed on the shoe. You've got the fear, no one, and then his signature logo right there. But this is the part that has changed with the eyes and the black, the mouth part right there. And then the knot from here right there. And then this is the first time I'm actually looking at this shoe and taking out of the box as well with you guys right here. So if you guys have any comments, please leave them below. But I wanna say that the bottom of these glow in the dark, but I don't know 100%. So if you guys know, please let me know as well. And then when you get to the back, you've got the metal three, like always, but then you've also got the, it's really neat. It says trick or treat. So that's really cool. But you see the, The pattern of the sole it really looks like it would glow in the dark i haven't had time to test it but then you've got this signature rare like always on the mb3 i, I want to say it does but like i said i wanted to just take it right out of the box and do a video on it without even looking at it one thing i think they did miss is if i think they should have given an extra set of laces with these black ones i think the black would have really set off you know the black in the shoe and this part here especially this but it's the first time I've looked at this like in person not in pictures so this retails for 140 what do you guys think are you going to be getting this I think it's a really if you're a collector and like Lamella Ball I think you should pick this shoe up definitely it's still available at puma.com or champs or wherever you get your shoes what do you guys think? I think this too is like the, it might signify like when you would like maybe cut out a jack-o'-lantern kind of like this part here. Again, I don't know. If you guys know, let me know. But this is what it looks like from the top. It, it is really, really a neat looking shoe. I definitely like it. But I also got a scale. Someone had told me that I needed to start weighing the shoes so I took someone's advice on that so I want to do this will be my first shoe I weighed this shoe weighs in at 15.6 ounces so I did take someone's advice and got a scale so I'll be start weighing shoes now so 15.6 ounces is what this weighs in at so I did get this and I'll be doing that from here out on all my shoes but let me know what you guys think. Are you going to be purchasing this shoe? Yes, no, leave the comments below. It's kind of been a slow run since basketball just now started back, but I'm kind of curious why LeBron hasn't dropped 
the 22s yet. I noticed that tomorrow he's releasing a, it's not an actual 22, it's a LeBron trainer shoe. If you guys have saw it, it's supposed to be releasing tomorrow. It's not the actual LeBron 22 and I will be picking that up. But I also have the John Morant purple colorway coming out from Nike. If you go look at that, it is on its way. That'll probably be here before the LeBron. So I'll be reviewing it next too as well. And I'll put a picture up in the video. You'll see it. The John Morant purple colorway. It's been shipped already from Nike. But I don't know why LeBron hasn't dropped the 22 yet or shown us what it's looked like because last year at this time the shoes were already out and we were able to order them but for some reason he's releasing a training shoe first so that drops tomorrow but let me know what you guys think of this yes no and please 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 hit the subscribe button at booze sneaker review 8 thank you